Bergdahl, the freed prisoner of war, getting That's some right. tough questions. Getting some questions, and the Army investigator expected to finish that questioning um, today of Sergeant Bo Bergdahl about his controversial disappearance in Afghanistan. And NBC's Gabe Gutierrez is at Fort, Fort Sam Houston in San Antonio, Texas. Gabe, good morning. Natalie, good morning. Sergeant Bergdahl's attorney says his client has waived his right to remain silent and is cooperating fully, apparently eager to tell his story and get this off his chest. This morning, Sergeant Bo Bergdahl is preparing to wrap up his first formal meeting with an Army investigator following his release by the Taliban. I think it was important and uh, useful for him uh, to be able to tell his own story and not have it told for him by anyone else. Eugene Fidel is Bergdahl's attorney. He says his client was read his rights Wednesday before the interview began at Fort Sam Houston, but Bergdahl answered every question for almost nine hours. This was really uh, a conversation. I think much of it was narrative uh, on Sergeant Bergdahl's part. Bergdahl was swapped more than two months ago for five militants held at Guantanamo Bay, triggering a national controversy. Major General Kenneth Dahl is investigating whether Bergdahl abandoned his post before the Taliban captured him. Among the questions, he's asked Bergdahl's fellow platoon mates what events led up to Bergdahl leaving, what was his intention, and where was he going? When a case is this serious, um, involving you know, national policy concerns as well as serious legal concerns during a time of war, it is significant that a major general is involved in an investigation for the government. That interview is expected to resume later this morning, and Bergdahl's attorney expected, expects it to last just a few more hours. After that, it'll be up to General Dahl to make a recommendation as to whether Bergdahl should be charged. And, Natalie, that recommendation could come later this month. All right. Gabe Gutierrez in Fort Sam Houston. Thank you.